didn't vlog for y'all this morning, but look. <laughs> it's like pitch black outside. Not, okay, not that dark, but like, this is not cute, so. And it is like 6.40. I think that's why it's been so hard for me to wake up this week. Like the last three days, I've slept in past my alarm. Last night, I made... I love how I say I'm, I was gonna try and vlog and then I'm, I'm vlogging still. Um, last night I made some hello, overnight oats, some pumpkin overnight oats for me and Jake, cause he had <coughs> to leave at like, like literally 3:45 or 4 o'clock or something crazy. So I made him some overnight oats. they weren't so freezing cold but it's fine i also need to take vitamin c because everyone around me is sick right now and i'm not getting sick i refuse i want to go to oktoberfest this weekend <laughs> best friend i think it's just because it's getting colder outside and people are getting colds from that but we take no chances anybody else know like recognize on tiktok when people use bloom like the greens that everyone talks about um it's gotten to the point where same thing with like it used to be like makeup products too would be like this on youtube it's gotten to the point where like literally everyone and their mom is working for them that like i don't believe that they're real i don't believe that they work anybody else Okay, so we just went to Coughlin because I was out of quite a few things, including dry shampoo. So I got these. I think somebody tell me in the US how much are these at like Home Goods or Marshalls because this is where I normally like what I would no where I would normally buy it. Um, and it was $2.99 for these, so I got three of them because your girl needs dry shampoo. And then I also got um, some eyebrow pencils because I've been not wearing eyebrow, like not doing my eyebrows for the last few days because I ran out of my eyebrow pencil and then I just kept not going out to get it. So yeah, but another thing we bought is grenadine. I don't, have we even ever bought grenadine before? So this one's showing like vanilla, blueberries, raspberries, but when I looked it up traditionally, it's made out of pomegranate. But I'm gonna try and make it in, in a drink. I don't know what I'm gonna drink, but we're gonna try something. What can I drink with vodka grenadine? We don't have orange juice, do we? No. Lemon juice. Yeah. Okay, so all we have for like soda-y stuff, we need to buy like Sprite or something, or uh, ginger ale. I love ginger ale. I have some Fanta. I don't know why I cannot pick a glass. Um, I guess I'll do this one. My favorite glass. So, what should I do first? Yeah, hopefully this will work. All these keys over there, huh? Yeah. Grenadine. I'm gonna put vodka in there first. Two shots of vodka. Sure. Is that a lot? I don't know, but it looks really pretty. <laughs> Not very cool looking, but oh well. I don't even taste it. Maybe I do, I don't know. Ta da! Cheers, happy Friday, everybody. Happy Saturday, everybody. Jake and I are doing some house stuff today. So we are doing a couple deep cleaning things that we only do every six months or so. And that is, one of them is to, Jake, we'll undo the pipes under our kitchen sink because we don't have a dispose, or a, what's that called? Yes, we don't have a dispose, a garbage disposal. So, I don't know. And I'm pretty sure these houses, like stairwells are like 20, if not 30, if not 40 or 50 years old. <laughs> so, we like to sometimes do some deep cleaning things that 
we shouldn't have to do, but we do just to be extra clean. But we are also going to head out as soon as I finish getting ready. And Jake's going to start taking the pipe stuff apart. And we're going to soak it in like something, like a disinfectant in the bathtub. And then I'm going to deep clean the bathtub later. But yeah, so that's what we're doing today. And then we're probably going to go over to Nuremberg and go to Ikea and TK Maxx. Because I've really been wanting to go to TK Maxx recently. So yeah. We're going to teach Jake the right way to do this. This stuff is not fantastic, like not a need to buy, but I, it like got about halfway down and I just refilled it cause you gotta get your money's worth, you know? You can't see me clean it. Okay, you wanna you have proof of this? I will give him some credit though because he does try to clean. It's just that I don't think it's good enough. You <laughs> should never give me credit off camera. Yes, I would, and I do. Look at how I'm holding it. See, now you're in the camera. <laughs> okay, we're about to leave, but I just want to show you this. Probably should put makeup on today. Oh, well. Um, I bought this on TikTok. Not on TikTok, but like from TikTok. It is a Brixley bag, and there's like a pocket in the front. Okay, I had to take it off to show you, but it's like really nice leathery pocket in the front with a zipper. Then there's a card holder in there. It's kind of dark, so you can't see it, but, and then there's a pocket, pocket thing, and then, and then a thing you can touch your keys to. And then there's a Velcro little pocket in the back. Brand new Velcro, it's so hard to open. And then I just stick my phone in here so it's like closer to my body whenever I wear it. And then you can wear it, I think it's like five different ways, maybe seven or something. You can wear it like a fanny pack, wear it like a little backpack. I don't know if there's a second, maybe you have to buy a second thing for it. I don't know, but I liked it on TikTok so I bought it. And I can't make it look right for some reason. I kind of want to get my, the, the bag that I wore to on our Italy trip had like stripes and it was a little thicker. I kind of think that would be a little bit cuter, but I think it's going to be the perfect travel bag. So yeah, I hate that you can't really see it, but yeah. And it was only like 40 bucks, I think. So, and we're off. Uh -oh. It's called mall seat. I don't know how to say it though. Pretty cool here. Okay, so we just ate at the place that I just put on the screen, but here's a picture of our food. At least mine. Do you take a picture of mine? Of yours? Yeah, just yours. Yeah, I don't know if I took a picture of <laughs> Can you yours? see here now? I took a kind of a crappy picture of mine, but um, it was pretty good. So if you're if you live in our area and you want to go to IKEA or TK Maxx or something in Nuremberg, Firth area. This was pretty good. Now we are headed out to TK Maxx and I have a couple things that I want to get replaced in our house, like bath mats. And then we need to get like a, a bath mat that like goes in the actual shower. So I'm gonna look for that, but um, we'll see how TK Maxx, I've been to TK Maxx in forever in a day, so. We made it to TK Maxx. Stop, so cute. So cute, can't handle it. Oh my gosh. I miss TJ Maxx and Marshall so much. I will find Christmas anywhere I go. Which one's your favorite? That one, this one's mine, the Christmas tree. It's a fall rainbow. Now we know where to go when we Jake gets me a dog. Got all kinds of, oh my gosh, how cute. Wow. So cute. Look at this 
little and all the toys Christmas toys are you kidding oh but I'm getting the bed that's the friend's bed I'll put it on the screen because it's precious and I love it so much but like there's leashes collars look at this chase and chomp and then there's a pizza cutter in the middle of dog toys <gasps> jackets bet you there's costumes in here oh my gosh this is so cute look at these little ghosts Are you kidding me oh i love it here oh my gosh stop batter jug utensil set I love it. It's so cute. It's out of focus because you keep moving it. There we go. I love Christmas. It's a little dark, but it's fine. Actually, it works. Uh, we just got done. We went to TK Maxx and Depot. And I'll show you everything we got when we get home. But we only got two things at Depot, so I'll show you now. We got these LED, like, um, lights because they won't ship candles unless it has a lid and it hasn't been lit or something. Is that what it was? Yeah. So, I mean, they did though. I don't know. If it doesn't have a lid, they won't ship it. Like candles that stick out like this, they won't ship it. So it's good to have these because I have two candlesticks that I need these like tall ones for. So now I have like an LED version and then they won't throw them away whenever I, whenever we move. I really wanted to go to Ikea today. But Jake doesn't want to go, so I guess I'll have to go by myself one day. How rude. How rude. I can only go right now if we get some of these meatballs. Okay. But no. <laughs> Why even say that? Okay, so yeah, we're headed home, unfortunately. Oh no, we're headed to a new, he said there's a new Lidl. We don't typically go to Lidl, L-I-D-L. Lidl, Lidl, to go grocery shopping, but he said there's like a brand new one. He said it looks like H-E-B. If you know what H-E-B is, you're a real one. That means you're from where we're from. Okay. New grocery store. We just made it home. It's nice and rainy. Do you see a little bit of fall? Let me see if I can zoom in. So we just got home, like I showed you, and I want to show you a couple things that we got because I said I would. At TK Maxx, oh, hopefully it doesn't get too dark, but we got these pumpkin pasta. Then I got new oven mitts, and I wanted fully black oven mitts, but this works. And Jake said, he was like, we're not even going to look at these all the time, so they don't have to like match anything but it's really nice so and we both agreed he has been wanting to get new ones for a long time because mine are kind of busted i got them i think my freshman year my sophomore year of college it's like i don't even know when that was four years ago five years ago six i don't know how long ago that was but <laughs> i got them then and they're kind of like ripping and stuff so he wants new ones we also got new whoop new kitchen towels because he hates the ones I got. I have these, wait, they're in the, they're about to be washed, but they're just plain black. And they're kind of like not really good quality. So we got some new ones. These are like black-ish, kind of gray, but like speckled black. So we got a new spatula and this one is like fully flat. There's no like holes in it and it has a nice wooden handle. So excited about this these strainers that are like different sizes so you can do like a drink strainer medium and then like a kind of small ish strainer my computer my camera's gonna die I just switched to my phone so I apologize if the quality is a lot different um you can still kind of see me I don't like the lighting of this so we're gonna go with this one instead then we got some pancake mix I thought Jake said this was pumpkin, but it's definitely not. I think he meant to get the pumpkin one. Oh well. I got some chili mango. I used to get this at Trader Joe's all the time. 
was only one. No, it was five ninety nine. Four ninety nine. I thought it was one ninety nine. Oh well. And then at Depot, I also got a new sourdough container because the one I have right now is right there. Do you see it? And it is the same Weck or Weck jar. I don't know how they say it in German, but these are all over the place. So this is what I keep my sourdough in right now. And I really wanted one that was like less round on the sides, more flat. So I got this one. So now we're going to keep my sourdough in here. I'm not going to airtight seal it because you shouldn't do that with sourdough. So there's that. Then at Lidl, we went and I got this. I don't know what they call this in German, but it's like a, I think it's called a mandolin or something where it like slices stuff and we don't have one. And I just saw it and got it. And then got this toffee mix popcorn. That's everything we got. I really still need, I'm probably gonna look maybe on Etsy or Target, I don't know, somewhere for new bath mats because we need new bath mats. And then a new bath mat that like goes inside the bath, you know, the little sticky bath mat. So those are two of the things that I needed. Oh, and I needed curtains because the light is always shining on our TV. So I think I'm gonna get those shades like roll down shades from ikea maybe i'll order some of those i don't know that's everything though i really hope you enjoyed this vlog don't forget to click that subscribe button down below but thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed my vlogs i know they're not as exciting when i'm not traveling but it's just my everyday life so i'll see you guys in my next video bye i know i said it ended the vlog already but look at this these are the candles i bought and then i have a remote and look, I can make them normal, just like lights, and I can make them really bright and really low. I hate this lighting. And then I can do candle where it like kind of flickers a little bit. I don't know if you'll be able to see it really. And then a timer, and then off. I'm way too excited about these.